you guys doing? I only have one week, not even, yeah, one week till school starts. I'm kind of excited about it because I'll be having a life again and doing stuff, but at the same time it'll be sucking to have to like get up early and go to class and all that shenanigans. But you know, it's part of being in college I guess, so YOLO. So I know in my last video and videos previous I've talked about like people hating on each other and bullying, but I've never really like talked about my experiences. I've only just talked about others' experiences and reflected on it. But maybe you guys should like hear mine so you can like understand like where I'm coming from, like why I'm so passionate about wanting hate to stop and wanting people to maybe be kinder to one another. Okay. For me, I guess it all really started really early in elementary school, like I could say by grade one, the cliques were already made, and I know that's weird to think that six and seven year olds are already grouping together and excluding other children out, but it does happen, and I've heard it even happen in kindergarten too, so it can happen early. But yeah, for me, it started happening around grade one, and it wasn't necessarily bullying personally on me, but it's just... You didn't hang out with these people, and you didn't hang out with these people. You hung out with this group. And luckily for me at this time, I had, I'd say, a pretty big group. I wouldn't say popular, but I had a group that I, like, stuck with. That were my friends. And then there were my friends from, like, dance and, like, outside of school and everything. And then I guess, like, bullying really started to get to me, like, people really being mean to me. It was in about the third grade. And it was just basically because I had anger issues and I didn't know to take proper I didn't know how to control them properly. I didn't have the right I don't want to say therapy, but like I just didn't know how to express my emotions. And I hurt a lot of people and I take it back every single day and I lost a lot of friends because of it. Like, I'll go on to later, but basically in the third grade is when it started, and is when I lost basically all my friends, like, even outside of school and everything, too. So basically from, like, end of third grade till, say, about fifth grade, I basically had, like, no friends. I had maybe, like, one or two friends, and if I was that, that was lucky, because by then, people were just being mean to me for no, like, I get why they were being mean to me, because I was mean to them. But they were being mean back to me on unnecessary terms that I just don't want to talk about. But yeah, so that's what really hurt me as a child. And along with all my LA family stuff that I don't want to talk about. But yeah, that for school, that's what happened. And then after that, people I started beginning nicer. And then people started being my friend again. And then so sixth grade when I started, it was pretty awesome. Like, when I entered sixth grade, I had legit friends, like, legit group of, like, girls that were friends, until, once again, I screwed it up. It was all my fault. I, I had a good thing going, and I ruined it by, again, not controlling my emotions. I started getting into physical fights. I started saying things that I don't even mean to this day and didn't even mean back then. I just said them because I didn't know what to do. Um, it was just a hard time. So the school actually made me go to a, um, a therapist at the school for about, I'd say, two months. The last two months of like grade six to like talk things out. 